Guys, I just woke up <laughs> and I just popped out of bed because the monster heads just jumped all over me. But oh my goodness, okay? Do you, you guys have seen, honey, can you sit down? I'm trying to put my beautiful face on the screen too. Okay, so um, if you guys have seen the show My Mad Fat Diary, you know who Sharon Look, Rooney is. Look, a bower. I made a bower. And it has a black mats. They're both mats. Cool. So if you've seen the show My Mad Fat Diary, you know who Sharon Rooney is. and She's the main character. She's the one who plays, you know. Um, I just woke up. Give me a second, okay? Um, uh, Ray. How did I forget that? We literally have the same name. Anyway, so if you know, if you ever watch my Mad Fadar, you know who she is. And she literally private messaged me on Twitter today, and it is her real account, okay? It's verified. And she's like, thank you so much for making the videos that you do. You've made my day. You're so inspiring. And then she messaged me again to say, oh, I didn't even know that you watched my Mad Fat Diary. I just saw the video that you did talking about it. Like, that is insane. That I can take someone who's literally inspiring the rest of you guys and myself. Like, that show changes things, okay? And then actually have an effect on them. Like, you know what? It just goes to show we are all just real people and we are all dealing with the same thing. It doesn't matter if you are an actress. It doesn't matter if everyone's looking up to you or not. We are all dealing with the exact same issues. And yet we go through life fighting each other and we go through life making other people feel bad when at the end of the day we have so many of the exact same issues. And I'm not just talking weight. I am talking... Financial issues. I'm talking family issues, relationship issues. We are all going through so much of the same thing, and that we're so many people are not just accepting of others, and we're not able to just exist. Like we are not able to coexist outside of our bedrooms because everyone thinks that we need to judge everyone and we need to be like pointing out faults of other people, and it makes no sense. Anyway, this was exciting, <clears throat> and. I really have to go pee. Oh, me too. Okay, you go pee first. Hi. <laughs> anyway, Hi. <laughs> that's motherhood. Hi. We're compromising, okay? Even though there are three bathrooms in this house, but that one's the closest. <laughs> All right, it's time to start our day. Right, baby girl? Yeah. Give me a high five. This is exciting. Boom. Uh. So, Roseanne is on, if you can see it over there. Roseanne is on, and I used to watch this literally every single day. It's only been the last, like, two months that I've kind of stopped because... For some reason, I pretty much never sit down to watch TV unless it's like 11 o'clock at night. And then I just watch crappy reality stuff. But um, Roseanne's like by far my favorite show like ever, like old school show. Because they deal with the issues, man. Feminism, sexism, weight issues, poverty, like they, um, gender and... Uh, like homosexuality they kept it all the way real on this show and i love that i am going to make a smoothie with those mangoes that we cut up the other day i don't know if i showed that to you guys in the vlog he likes them and some pineapples i've never done this before so we and a little soy milk so we'll see how this goes and hopefully this bad boy gets it done you guys want some Nala's a liar. She doesn't ever eat it, so don't let her fool you. Throw it up, throw it up. Watch it all fall out. Mm. Pull it up, pull it up. This is how we ball out. Mangoes and pineapples. Can't eat no solids. I don't think anyone... I don't think anyone understood the first time that I did this in the video that I was making a smoothie because I literally cannot eat solids right now. Um... You know what though, um, these these smoothies work out well for me because I end up, you know, I'm able to consume them. However, I need to add protein. That's one of my biggest issues with the lap band is that I need to be constantly consuming protein because you end up basically not getting enough because it's protein's a hard thing to, to eat to actually make you go through the band. So if any of you guys have any suggestions for what kind of like powdered whey protein or any sort of flavored protein that you have that you like or whatever drop it below i will be totally grateful because i don't even know where to start so i'm just chilling we normally take baths right after breakfast but i got really sucked into roseanne today <laughs> i 
so we haven't taken baths yet. So they're probably going to take baths and then go straight to bed, and then I'll go straight to the shower, and then put up a vlog from Tuesday or Wednesday. I might just skip Tuesday and put up Wednesdays. Um, we did go out and do some stuff Tuesday, though, so. Hi. Hi, gorgeous bubble. You see his tan? Look at mom versus Jay. Mama, I want to get this off of here. Hashtag pale life. Mama. Let me talk about me and Jaden and how much I love him for some Mama, time. Mama, with you too. Talk with me too. Talk about me too. <laughs> I love you too, Nala. Talk You're great me. too, Nala. Attitude. I want to talk about. Hashtag. Awesome. Hashtag Bubba. Hashtag Bubba. I I want to talk it too. Your eyes are cracking. I don't understand what you're saying. I want to talk it too. Your eyes are cockatoos. Yeah, my eyes are. Cockatoos. Got it. His eyes are cockatoos. That dude. That is a handsome man. I don't care what anybody says. GI Joe's can be handsome too. That's a handsome man right there. <laughs> Who else is a handsome man? Me. Me. Yeah. <laughs> he won. <laughs> so I have cleaned up the kitchen and the living room area thing. I should give you guys a tour one day because the house kind of goes on forever. There's more rooms over there and then around and back and up here. <laughs> anyway, um... Cleaned up the kitchen, cleaned up the living room, cleaned up the kitchen, and I'm taking the babies upstairs so that we can take a bath. I'm so hungry. My stomach hurts. Oh, you know what? I'm probably dehydrated. That's what it is. Let me get a bottle of water before I go up. Look at that. Do my rounds. Woo! Feel the burn. Um, the babies are dressed and ready for night night time. I'm about to read them a little. Skepito. It's called Skippy John Jones, but he calls himself Skippito Fresquito. And Chonies, those are for after nap time. Yeah. And I just did Nala's hair, and I'm really insecure about my French braiding, okay? Or braiding, period, really. I'm not very good at it. So I practiced the Elsa look, sort of. It's like a braid on one side, braid on the other side, coming down in one braid. And I'm going to show you how it came out. So that's Jaden's beautiful hair. Sweet orange polo. It's from Target, in case anyone's wondering. He's got some cargo shorts on. He's looking pretty fly for a white guy. And black guy and Mexican guy. There's a French braid on this side. And then yeah, um, there's a French braid on the other side, I think, sort of. And then it all came down to one braid. I don't know. Are those even called French braids? I don't know what I'm doing. Anyway, I'm going to read this Skipito Skipito and we're going to go night night. Hey, stop it. So the babies are asleep. Nala is in her room right there. And Jaden is in his room all the way over there. Second door. And um, I need to take a shower and get dressed for the day because I need to uh, go to this meeting sort of last minute, but it's really important. And so I need to go and do that and I need to make a couple stops beforehand. And your girl has not had Starbucks in like a whole, I don't even know, since Sunday. It's Friday. It's been too damn long. So we will be hitting up Starbucks on our way out unless we're running late, which is a big possibility because I am always running late. So yeah. Anyway, I just fell asleep with my daughter, of course, so I set an alarm, and I woke up. Um, yeah, so let's go get ready and get beautiful, girl. Okay, I'm running super late, but I'm going to give you guys a quick little outfit for the day. So um, I have this sweet shirt. It's got, like, just a bunch of tri or rectangle-looking things on it. I put a belt on because it's actually super just loose and flowy. Um, and then I have my, this is from Torrid. The top is from Torrid. And then my jeans, I have the jeans also from Torrid. These are like their skinny, um, what are they called? It's their super skinny jeggings or something like that. And then my shoes are these wedges, which you guys should have seen already in Out for the Day. Um, those are from Target. And I love the shirt because in the back, let me not try to kill you. In the back, it um, like dips down and it's super cute. And then of course, taking my fave, my Aldo bag. So, oh, and um, this is what my face looks like. So, pretty downplayed, little pink lip, muted pink lip. And um, that's it. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Stars, they burn, sun, we did fall to the earth. We got a lot to learn. God knows we're worth it. I wish that I was in 
a shitty relationship where I need to be like, oh baby, I won't give up on us. <laughs> no boo, we're gonna be together. We're gonna make it. Like, it's, it for real. Cause I can't even sing this song with like anyone in my mind because I certainly don't want to make it work with Dum Dum. And um, the new guy and I are good, so. So I'm home and I'm making dinner for the little munchkins. I'm actually watching their cousin too. She is right there and that's my baby girl and Jay. So anyway, I'm making this Rana pasta. Have you guys ever had this? Because, oh my God. I don't eat box pasta because I can't really consume it. Not that I never will or I won't, but it's just difficult so I don't really buy it. Anyway, I love this brand and then it comes with like the perfect size of whatever, like you can get Alfredo or marinara. The other one starts with a B. Why can't I remember what it's called? Anyway, so I'm making them this because the babies love it. And some little like Angus beef meatballs. Protein. Right now they're all munching on bread. Anyway, my meeting went so good. I'm so excited. Yay! Um, I've been cooking for like six minutes and I've already successfully burnt the meatballs, so yeah. This housewife thing is not for me, so if you're looking to put a ring on a finger, you need to be looking to hire yourself a little lady to come up in our house to make us dinner and cook and clean for us and do all that because no. I'm starting to think cooking isn't for me anymore. I used to do it. I didn't suck at it or anything, but these days, I'm just getting rocked. I've been getting rocked in the kitchen lately. Not in a good way. Just, ugh. Although, hey, I'm having an okay hair day. Can't complain about that. Yeah, baby, you can have something with dinner, so you gotta wait a couple minutes. Cause we're having burned meatballs, yum. My only hope is that they eat some of it. Not all of it, not 50% of it. I will be happy with 20% of that plate being gone. Two, zero. Let's go. So dinner is done. I'm still sitting here. Everyone else is over there yelling at each other, all the little kids. Nala probably ate like 10% of her food, maybe. She drank all her juice, of course. Jaden maybe 15, and Elle ate all of it, including some of Jaden's food. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. Parenting woes. I didn't even finish all of mine, so I can't even front. So I am about to wrap up the night, but I got, I don't know, I've been really hungry. <laughs> I think it's because I kept throwing up. So it makes it so that, I mean, I end up consuming very little food and then I'm really hungry by the end of the night. So I did fix myself a little midnight snack. Literally midnight because it is 11.58. Okay, so it's not literally midnight, but it's about literally midnight. Um, and it's adorable. I'll show you. And I have my little snack. Isn't she cute? It's just a banana with like peanut butter and granola because I don't know. I don't, you know, I like sweet crap and, and sweet things are the easiest for me to consume. So yeah, sweet, but you know, got protein and stuff. Granola and peanut butter both have protein. I'm going to go to sleep soon. I'm very tired and I will see you guys in the morning.